So we are now in Unit 2, Lesson 1, and we are going to go to prezi.com, P-R-E-Z-I.com, and we're going to use the Get Started button, the large blue button down here, or up here on the top right hand side. You're going to see all the op options for, for creating your own Prezi here. We're not going to do Enjoy, we're not going to use Pro, we're not going to use Teams. Over here on the side it says Public and we are going to select Continue Free. And the reason it is free is because all of your Prezi's will be available to the public. Now here we are going to create our own account. Put my name, my last name, now here. I am putting uh, an email account I created for this. It's going to be handy that you always use your Gmail account for every one of these lessons. Just want to re-emphasize that. Go ahead and create your password. And I'm an edu in education. Why all the questions? Uh, let's see. We're going to go with other. And I do not, I'm not going to select this one. I don't want to try the new uh, beta or Prezi beta. So, name, email, password, what you do. And then create your free public account. And here I have, it gives me a little get started tutorial. It tells me how it works. You can feel free to go through it. We're going to be reviewing all of this together. So don't fret. Don't be scared with all the flying graphics. And um, start creating. In the, next, in the next lessons, we'll actually go through creating your own Prezi doing collaborative uh, group projects and uh, pretty much bringing it to life in your classroom as a student or a teacher.